Good evening, Valparaiso area. My name's Alexa Minton. I'm your VU 15 News Weather Director here with a Sunday evening weather update. Taking a look at our live look at the moment, we actually get to see some blue skies and some sunshine for the Valparaiso area. However, this sunshine is masking a little bit of cold air. We currently are sitting around 29 degrees in Valpo, and we've had some clouds throughout the day with this sunshine only coming out as we head into our evening hours, giving us some clear skies as we head into the night tonight. We're going to see those clear skies maintain into parts of tomorrow morning and Monday. And in fact, we're actually going to have a brief warm up in a little bit in this week. We're going to see us warm up up to the 60s on Wednesday. However, rain will tamper us back down to those cooler temperatures and even chances for some rain snow mix, giving us a cold and chilly weekend ahead as we head into April. Taking a look at our current temperatures, as I mentioned already, we are sitting around those upper 20s in Valparaiso, Michigan City, South Bend. Those areas directly south of the lake, there's some northerly flow at the moment with some winds kind of tampering down, keeping us just a little bit colder than our friends southwest of the lake at the moment. Chicago O'Hare is sitting at 35, and a couple areas around that southwest region of the lake are just a tad bit warmer than us. However, it is still pretty cold in comparison to the rest of the nation at the moment. We had quite the dominant dominating cold air mass yesterday and that seems to have completely shifted towards parts of the east coast as we see this kind of warm tropical air push up and now dominate the Rocky Mountain region and parts of the west coast. We now get to see 77 in Albuquerque which was just pretty chilly for them yesterday and they have quite the big 24 hour temperature change for them and we get to see some more warmth even in Houston 79. We see even more relief from that cold air for our friends down on the southeast coast with 63 in Birmingham 79 down in Miami and this warmth will touch us for just a hair on Wednesday. However, we're probably going to be staying in this nice cold air trough, cold air mass for just a tad bit longer as we look ahead. Looking at our live radar, we see not too much activity actually happening for the Valparaiso region. Some remnants of some scattered showers and scattered precipitation from that storm is kind of affecting the Valparaiso area, but nothing really too impactful. As we look off to our east coast, though, we get to see that storm kind of dominating the parts of New York State and Pennsylvania as it shifts off and rotates into the Atlantic Ocean. We see it even stretches down as far as parts of southern Ohio, even West Virginia. We're seeing it give them some snow snowfall down there, but this storm isn't going to be affecting Valpo at all anymore. Maybe just a couple of scattered showers. Our new system will be coming later this week. Looking at our future temperatures, we see we cooled down to 24 on Monday. And as we look ahead, we see that we're going to warm up just slightly to 33. However, the real action comes when we look at Tuesday. We start off Tuesday early, early morning hours, pretty cold with about 26 degrees. And we start to warm up throughout the day all the way up to 39, giving us some nice warm weather as we head into Wednesday. Wednesday is going to see be when we see that temperature spike. And this is all because of our uh, Tuesday afternoon hours giving us some nice warm as it kind of comes in and warms it up just a tad. Looking at our future radar, not too much activity. We're going to have awfully clear skies throughout the night tonight and even into parts of tomorrow morning. We see at 7.30 a.m. there's not too much happening in the Valparaiso region. Nothing really actively happens until we look at about early, late afternoon hours for Valparaiso as we see this nice thick band of clouds kind of roll in. And at about 9 p.m., 7 p.m., we're going to notice those clouds kind of dominate Valparaiso. No precipitation yet. We'll save that for Wednesday. But Monday, we're going to notice quite the heavy clouds and those clouds will be prominent throughout the day on Tuesday. As we take a look into our tonight and tomorrow forecast, we see we're going to cool down to about 21 degrees tonight. And as I mentioned, we're going to have awfully clear skies throughout the night. And tomorrow we're going to see some chances of some sunshine, but pretty much majority clouds as we head into the evening with a chance of 32 for our warm up. Looking at our seven day forecast, it is important to note that today, while we are chilly here in Valparaiso, it is 32. I know that there's a special lady down in Georgia who it is her birthday, so she gets the chance for a little bit of warmer weather. Happy birthday. Hey, Mom, I wanted to wish you a happy birthday. We see chances for some warm up here on Tuesday. And as we head into Wednesday, we do get to see a chance for even warmer, warmer weather. However, that's going to be immediately tapered down by that rain. It is important to note on Wednesday, we see a 36 for our low, which is, means we're going to have kind of a sandwich with cold air, warm air, and then cold air on top. So while that air and uh, might be disguised as warm in the middle of the day, it will be having some bits of precipitation. 
Thursday, we are seeing that we are going to be having some warmer weather, but chances for some rain snow mix thanks to that cold air. And finally, that precipitation begins to move out, leaving us with just clouds on Friday. And as we head into April this weekend, we're going to notice that that sunshine comes out, but doesn't really do too much to help us warm up.